I may have bought something. Just a little something. Just a little, little something. I bought tree pickers. I've been needing a set, and I was like, I'm gonna buy a set. Fourth of July came around, and uh, found a discount code. I was like, hell with that. I'm gonna see if I can buy some, and I did. So I may have gotten antsy and opened the box already, and I'm happy I did because they have these things packaged so well that it took me, I'm not even kidding, probably 10 minutes to get just one of them undone. But uh, basically on my last buggy, I didn't really have anything uh, custom fab related. I say custom fab, just basically made from like <laughs> custom fabricators. Uh, I went with ORB. So uh, my last side-by-side, -side, I had a set of radius rods from LNW. Absolutely love them, nothing against them. But I have a buddy who has a four seat Pro XP. So mine is two, his is a four, and he has these uh, tree kickers on his and I absolutely loved them. And these things are beefy. I was not expecting them to be this heavy. Uh, you can take that for what it's worth. Some of you guys may not want heavy duty. Uh, I did on the other hand, and these things are an absolute unit. I believe they're 120 wall. And there is three points of mounting. So one, two, and three. And it's gonna go right there, one and two and three. So I'm gonna go ahead and take off the factory skid plate underneath of there. Uh, it's 10 millimeter bolts. I don't know how many, but uh, yeah, you gotta take those off to get uh, put these on. So I'm gonna do that right now. So in order to get to the back side of these tabs right here, oh, yep, there you go. The back side of these tabs, you have to drop the skid plate here. Uh, they are up underneath of here. Uh, there's one, two, and three on the driver's side. So I'm gonna assume there's three on the passenger side. One here up underneath, uh, close to where the trailing arm would be. Three on the back side there. One in the middle. Uh, I'm not too entirely sure how many they are. But like I said, you gotta take this off just to get to the back side of the, the mounting tabs. Uh, mine has a washer with it and uh, you're not gonna be able to get the bolt in there anyway. So I'm gonna put the phone down and I'm gonna get this knocked out real quick. So I went ahead and just took the, the driver's side seat out here to get access to this third mounting point right here. Uh, so now that I have th that out of the way, it should be good to go. So I'm gonna start putting these in and gonna throw the camera back up on the tripod. All right, here's the plan. I'm going to do is I'm gonna put these on. Uh, I am gonna put a little, little bit of uh, Loctite on them just cause I don't want it to vibrate loose in the middle of the trails. That would suck. Uh, just gonna do some little don't need any more than that. Uh, what I would recommend if I were you though, is this front mounting point here, a little tight. I don't know, I don't got underneath it to look, but uh, something is in the way. So what I'm gonna do is set this middle one and the one back here first, hold it up in there nice and tight, and then I'm gonna go ahead and do the front one. And then I'm gonna do it on time-lapse and I'll show you when it's all done because there's no point in doing both of them when it's literally the same thing on the other side. Well, I know it's a little dark out, but just finished this up and I am absolutely loving the way these look. Uh, like I said, the only thing I don't like is when you look at it from the front here. Uh, I don't know. It just, it needs wheels. It needs wheels badly. 
at least for me it does, but uh, this is what it looks like though. Another thing I do like is if you take, look from here and then take a step back, uh, it does actually go a little bit uh, closer towards the back wheel there, so it takes, uh, takes that gap and kind of closes it out a little bit, but uh, that is it though. I will say this though, I don't know if I just got lucky with the, uh, let's see if I can, can I lighten this up here? Oh, sweet, ooh, a little too much here. That'll do right there. Uh, I may have gotten lucky, that bolt right there was a pain in the ass to get done. But, um, yeah, that's it though. All good, and next thing I have is a winch, and I need to get that done quick, because I leave for Tennessee and actually a week from today yeah we from today i leave for tennessee so i still can't get over this thing though Soccer and 40 other things, but I will get it done per usual. 